<laughs> he likes to do that, man. He he loves the camera. He's a good guy, so I can't uh, I can't even hate. <laughs> that's mild, though. Yeah, he's very very charismatic. Yeah, he's. Yeah, can't even be mad about man. that. Uh, but yeah, Gengar versus Sceptile. Sceptile comes out on top. Uh, yeah. you, let me ask you a question. If you didn't play Suicun, who would you play? Uh, Weavile. I always play, so I always play a blue character or an ice character, and if possible, a blue and ice character. Wow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I really like the control mages. Why blue? Is, I mean, so I don't know. Blue is my favorite color. Yeah, I mean, I have, my and favorite color is, uh, you know, blue. But dude, <laughs> that's not how I pick my characters. Look, man. No, I understand. It, <laughs> I mean, I have a pretty so, bad. So also, I like to play OP. If Suikun ended up being trash, <laughs> then I probably would play something else. But he's like blue. But he's blue and he's amazing. Let's okay, see so this. even if he was like blue, he, if he was bad, you wouldn't play him. It's tricky. I would probably fight to play him until my spirit was broken. Like, what's happening with your bricks? Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> that was the ultimate call out. <laughs> Sorry, DC. Well, anyway, my Mewtwo is coming soon. <laughs> your Mewtwo is coming soon? Yep. Uh, yeah, Mewtwo is pretty cool. Mewtwo is pretty cool. Once I finish that story mode in like three months, I'm gonna start, I'm I'm start doing training. I might actually. I don't know. I, I don't know who I would actually pick as a secondary. All right, so now once again we have Esam versus Esam versus the Gardevoir that player. Uh, his name escapes me unfortunately. And though this I don't is know, a, but they're both hype. A new game with a bunch of new, uh, you know, first tournament with new entrants. So a lot of the players are still relatively unknown. And Masquerade, there we go, Masquerade. Masquerade, yes. So, so Gardevoir should win the field phase. Yeah, this seems like a really good Libre doesn't have many options from far away. He does have that air homing attack, uh, yeah. which can be good against zoners, but you gotta be careful with it. Of course, very punishable. Wow. Very sleek play here from the Gardevoir. Again. Gonna continue to zone him out. Yeah, so this is actually one of the matchups where I feel like a regular Pikachu might do a little bit better than Pikachu Libre. P regular Pikachu can fight from a distance as well as a post. I think his damage output is a little bit lower than Pikachu or, or Arpiga, but... That's a very nice grab. Yeah, grab. Shield, grab, win. And you, <laughs> that's, you know, you say it, it sounds obvious, but a lot of people will not do that. They will always try to oh, attack no, everything. I was actually pretty serious. <laughs> <laughs> Runs up, grabs up. That was really smart because he knows that Gardevoir is probably going to counter attack once he gets in close. Yeah. Uh, Pikachu Libre with Toja Kiss assist, making him a little bit faster. Or making, I'm sorry, making her a little bit faster. Going to be uh. Try to do a cross up there. But now Wildcard's getting stuck. I don't know what that's called, but. Which one? Uh, when you do call mind into that explosion around you. Uh, that one. Or is that just called mind. That's just dazzling. Daz All the pressure. It should be safe, yeah. Yep. Still shot wild charge. I like how he covers something. Charge. He covers something relatively unsafe with something extremely unsafe, and it works out for him. So. <laughs> uh, Even he knows that. He's yeah. laughing like, I can't believe I got away. It's so funny because he plays Pikachu Libre the same way he plays Pikachu in Smash 4. He just goes in. He doesn't care what happens. Love it. Drops the last hit of the uh, walk-off. Yeah, that was looking good. At least I'm letting go of his counter a little bit early. Uh, that's the second time we've seen there that air holding attack get punished. It's gonna keep happening. But it we're is, probably gonna see a grab next time. Yeah, it, it is really, really good against a zoner, but you gotta be careful when you use it. Slowly really making his way with these other jolts. Oh, he's MC. He doesn't care at all. Nope. Not gonna connect. And that's gonna mainly gonna use his first attack. This. this pressure, so intense. Yeah. It really gets into your head when you see a Pikachu Libre running at you. Especially uh, you know, once you immediately use Toad Kiss, I would I use Toad Kiss as soon as possible before uh, oh, I think you lose he tried to double team that, but still got caught. Good damage has that uh, attack for Oh, someone's been labbing. Speed buff up. <laughs> oh no, I wonder oh. if he let go of his oh, counter dear. early. Counter attacks again. 
Yeah, because it looked like uh, Isam started his counterattack first. But maybe let go early and got hit by a Masquerade yeah, counterattack. Yeah, I think that did happen. Well, let's see what happens here. Uh, that was a relatively close match, Isam. Uh, was not able to clutch it out, but. Isam's smart. He knows to, to expect that counterattack now. Yeah. Hopefully, he knows to hold on his counter a little bit longer. I feel like if you're going to do a counterattack, you either let go immediately or you hold it for the entire duration. <laughs> Yeah. There's a perfect into a wall combo into Electro Web. Beautiful. Yeah, so this uh, speed debuff on Barbar is actually going to help him out a lot. This is going to help him get in much, much easier. Comes with QQ. Or, or so I thought. <laughs> Uh, man, I wonder if Kisa a... plays Pikachu at all, regular Pikachu, because... I'm not sure. He's really having a hard time making He's his way He's been playing Libre since it came out though, right? Yeah, as far as I know. But I'm actually not sure how often he plays this game. Uh, he plays pretty <laughs> often, actually. He, 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 yeah? I, as you can tell, he knows what he's doing, but... Oh, this is, like we said, by that. this is a matchup that not many people have experience in, because this character is so rare. Yeah. Masker's playing very... Very good right now. Yeah, the unfortunate thing about playing Pikachu Libre is that uh, this is actually a surprise. You see a lot of Pikachu Libre, so you pretty much know what's gonna, what's gonna happen. Well, I think we all know Isam likes to go ham, and you really have to play this matchup patiently. So that has to be pretty conflicting. <laughs> yeah, that's, <laughs> that's the truth for sure. Oh, okay, this is gonna ah. catch him. Uh, he does have the defense. Yolo. He has the defense buff from being in synergy burst, but uh, Isam has the flashing red health and <laughs> does oh. a Pikachu slam <laughs> in his chair again. Oh, Isam! Wow, styling dodge there. Oh, dangerous! Wow, dodges that. That was kind of a dangerous thing to do on somebody's wake up. I think that was up Y. I think she was up Y. Yeah, Masquerade has 